friends, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Arlise and I love baking treats and cooking up eats. Today, I have started a new series called Arlise Tries. So today I'm going to try for you an Italian inspired some stuff cannelloni. Friends, let's get started. Friends, for your ingredients, we have here our cannelloni. We are going to be needing a cup and a quarter of your marinara sauce. We have here two teaspoons of chopped garlic. Friends, you're going to be needing some black pepper and you can add as much as you need. Some salt. You're going to be needing a half a cup of Parmesan cheese and a little bit more for serving. You're going to be needing one and a half tablespoon of olive oil. I have here a cup of mozzarella cheese, a 12 ounce of the ricotta cheese. However, I am using the cream cheese because members of my family don't like the ricotta. So I'm using the cream cheese. And then we have our four cups of spinach. You're going to be needing one egg. Friends, you're going to be needing some fresh basil. However, I do have some frozen ones that I'm going to use. And you're going to be needing your piping bag. And this is for stuffing the cannelloni. Friends, now we're adding our cannelloni to our boiling water with a bit of salt. And we're not going to overcook them, but we're going to cook them until they're tender enough, but not soft to break. Friends, now that the cannelloni is partly cooked, I'm draining them off and we're going to set them aside to cool enough for them to be stuffed. Friends, now we are going to be adding our olive oil to our pan. And like I said, that was a tablespoon and a half of olive oil. And this is on low heat. Friends, now we are adding our garlic. And we are going to be cooking the garlic until they are starting to be golden brown. Before we add our spinach. So this you're cooking for about two to three minutes. Now we're going to be adding our spinach. So now the spinach is reducing, so it should reduce to about half, but they're still very green. So we're going to be sitting this aside to cool. Friends, now in a separate bowl, you're going to be adding your spinach. Your mozzarella cheese. your cream cheese and then our parmesan then we add in our basil we're going to be adding some salt and pepper and you're just going to add, I'm adding to my taste. So you just add the amount that you desire. And just a splash of salt. And you're going to combine that together. And friends, I am only using the egg white. So now you're going to be mixing all this together. Thank you. 
friends you're going to be pouring half of the sauce into your baking dish i'm just going to move that around to cover the bottom of the dish my daughter goes put more sauce We just need to cover the bottom of the dish because we're going to be adding more sauce on top but i did add some more sauce now in your piping bag you're going to be adding your your filling you're going to take your cannelloni and stuff using your piping bag and you're going to be placing them in your dish you're going to be uh, line them up properly one by one now you're going to be covering your cantaloni with the remaining marinara sauce friends I'm going to be placing this in the oven but first I'm going to cover it with foil and it's going to be staying in the oven for 25 minutes then I'm going to remove it take the foil off and then put it back in for another 10-15 minutes It has been 25 minutes since our cannelloni is in the oven. So now I'm, I'm removing the oil and I'm going to be placing them back in the oven for another 10 minutes. And they're looking gorgeous. Friends, I'm going to place back in the oven for 10 for 15 minutes actually. They were in the oven for. And now this is the end result. Friends, now we're going to top it off with some of the Parmesan cheese. And I have here some dry parsley. So I'm going to be just sprinkling that over the cheese. And enjoy! This is the end result of the Italian inspired cannelloni. If you made it this far in the video, I greatly appreciate you. Thank you for watching. Thank you for liking the videos. Please let me know how I did in the comments below. Subscribe. Turn on your post notification bell so you don't miss a video. God bless you all. Stay safe. Stay blessed. And I'll see you in the next one. Mwah.